Hey Saints, what's going on? This is Brian, Love Has a Name YouTube channel. Welcome back. Got a bit of a, a, bit of a fun background there. Uh, no sound, of course, but the main event for this video is a Hank Kuhneman prophetic word. Make sure you look in the description so that you know that you can always look into, research, contact, and learn more about Hank Kuhneman's wonderful ministry. All the details will always be in the description for you. I love Pastor Hank Kuhneman. Um, I love his wife, his church, and I am excited for the day that the Lord will lead my wife and I over there to Omaha, Nebraska, to visit the church, or perhaps another state where he's visiting. That would be such an honor and such a blessing. Amen. This prophetic word actually came forth at the prophetic conference in Ohio at Pastor Tim Sheets Church. Um, I don't recall that I have ever seen, whoa, <coughs> that I've ever seen Pastor Hank Kuhneman and Apostle Tim Sheets together. Um, I know Dutch Sheets and Hank Kuhneman have been on Flashpoint several times, but I thought it was so cool. And this word ended up being so powerful. In fact, if I'm not mistaken, Hank Kuhneman had two prophetic words during that weekend. All right. Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Let's just pray. Let's pray. Let's honor and let's acknowledge the Lord. And we will dive right into this powerful word. Father, I thank you in the name of Jesus. We love you, Jesus. We love you, Holy Spirit. We come together as one body. And we are excited to hear what the Spirit of God is saying. And what he had spoken during this prophetic conference, Lord. That just passed recently at the beginning of this month. Lord, we give you room and we ask you to flow freely. Have your way. Lead the entire word in the name of Jesus. And we praise you and we thank you and we honor your name and your presence, your anointing and the glory. Amen. Amen. All right. I forgot to mention today. Today is February 23rd, 2024. All right. Here is the prophetic word. Let's get right into it. Oh, yes. Before I forget. Two days ago, I did upload a video. It was a Diana Larkin prophetic word called Phony Christianity. If you haven't seen that one, friendly reminder, take some time. It is a little bit on the longer side, but it was powerful. A lot of, lot of practical and yet profound teachings that are going to help you. Uh, many, many people have already commented to the glory of God that what was spoken was very helpful to them. So we are so excited for them because we want change and a catalyst of change to come forth and bring transformation in the lives of the people. These are the type of things that happened to me as I would watch YouTube videos from different servants of God throughout the last handful of years, which transformed my life. And, and as the Lord brought me here to social media, I absolutely am going to emphasize and emphasize and emphasize and repeat and repeat and repeat because his presence and his anointing is there and because I am thankful and grateful in my heart for how God used others, many of whom I've never even met. Uh, one at least, Neville Johnson, who's already gone home to the Lord, who, whom I did not have the honor yet of, of, um, of meeting in person, but... Uh, I actually did have one encounter in the spirit where he spoke to me. But hey, cloud of witnesses type of things that happen. Um, anyway, I say all that because it is important. That's why I honor the servants of God. And that's why I there's a strong uh, teaching through me. And that is why I'm recommending the video so that it can help you. Amen. Okay. Praise God. Let's start. Let's start. Here's the word. February 2nd, 2024 at Oasis Church. 
the Spirit of God came upon Hank Kuhneman, and he spoke. And so it is, says the Spirit of God, as I am hovering over the earth at this time. I am waiting, and I am listening for those who will decree, who will speak forth my word and my words, who will declare and say, let there be. For I am coming to counter, as I did in the days when the earth was without form, void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep. I spoke, and I declared, let there be light. And so I say to you, there is a revolution that is taking place. You say, is this a revolution for blood? The Spirit of God says, the enemy, they are speaking in the very bowels of hell. Give us war. Give us war. Give us blood. But I have released a revolution, and it's a revolution of light. It is a purposeful overthrow of the darkness at this time. Therefore, pay attention. Pay attention to Texas. You have been known as Texas, but I declare that you are Texas. And you have said, you are a lone star, but watch what I do. For what is being seen upon the screens concerning you, Texas, is the spirit of reform. That shall shake this country, and there shall be a division that has been upon this land. But must, I remind you, says the living God, of the days where there was division that was created by the power of my hand when I split open the Red Sea. Yet I divided it upon the left, and I divided it upon the right. Why? So I could show my preservation to a nation. I could show my power to people, but I could drown the works of darkness. For out of the division that would seem to arise at this time, Texas shall cause a reform that shall bring forth new legislation. And those who will come out and begin to stand and you will be amazed. You will be shocked. You will be in awe as those who come and align themselves with Texas and for justice. Wow. Let me pause right there. If you are from Texas, comment below. Say, I am in Texas or I live in Texas. If you want to give the city Praise the Lord. Share with us. Uh, say, I am in Corpus Christi, Texas. I am in Dallas, Texas. I am in San Antonio, Texas. All right. Let's see how many Texans are watching this video. Amen. God bless Texas. All right. The word of the Lord continued. And God says, this is only the beginning, says the Lord. Look greater. Look greater. For I speak and I say, you are not just the United States, but you are linked on purpose with Canada. You are linked with Mexico. And I say, my plan for you shall be declared and known as North America the Great. Oh, let's put that in the comments. North America the Great. Ooh, maybe somebody wants to combine it. Ooh. Type in Canada plus the United States plus Mexico equals North America, the great. The word continues. Why do I speak this, says God? Because I will shake your governments. I will remove your leaders that have stood and defied and brought forth immorality and corruption. They have shook hands in secret. 
This is not the way that you will see of the, your future. For I speak a new hour, I speak a new day. And I will raise up new leadership in Canada. And you will say, oh, look at us. Oh, Canada. For God says, I will show you what righteousness looks like, Canada. I will show you what justice looks like. And I will show you the power of a couple who will stand together hand in hand. As your land was divided, this couple shall arise to join the hands in Canada that shall reach across to the one I have raised up. Whoa, thank you, Lord. Saints, I know many of you are in Canada watching. Let us know in the comments. Type in, I am in Canada. And if you are inclined to do so, let us know what city, what, um, I don't even know if province if that's how you say it there for you canadians <laughs> let me know oh man I, i'm just buzzing with the anointing i can feel it on my hands thank you jesus thank you for the power of your words and the power of your presence and your spirit on this word that is being released to your people lord god if they will just connect all right let's finish up this word now the lord says for what you have seen is counterfeit but I will raise up a cord of three strands in you, United States, and I will show you what a true prez looks like. Okay, uh, I'm speaking in um, in code P R E S I D E N T. I will show you what a true one looks like again. I will show you what a true administration looks like again. And I will raise up a cord of three strands, my man, another man, and a woman shall arise to and shall be a cord of three strands. For I will place my hand very powerfully upon a woman at this time to stand. For you have looked and seen what counterfeit looks like. Now I will show you the truth, and I will show you that which comes by the way when my people pray, and I have my say. You watch. I have come to reset. And Mexico shall arise as new leadership shall come, and they shall say, we want to help you with the borders. Oh, hallelujah. We want to bring about a sense of order. You say, this is impossible. Oh, thank you, Lord God. You say, this is impossible. Who are you listening to, says the Spirit of God. I speak from my throne, and I say it. You will be called North America the great whoa and the prophetic utterance of the lord ends right there wow thank you god short powerful the lord speaks regarding texas specifically in america the lord spoke for canada and the lord spoke about mexico oh the lord is amazing here he's about to join the three and then the lord spoke about his man that's dt and another man and a woman a three Oof, as i'm speaking I'm, 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 I'm the lord is bringing out of me what he spoke in his word these patterns patterns oh isn't god awesome so awesome lord we thank you for this word i'm just looking through it right now to see if there's anything else that stands out I don't believe anything else is standing out. Oh, this is awesome. And this word, I don't know if I mentioned it before, hopefully I did, was February 2nd, 2024. So that's 2-2, two, two. okay, number 22. To me, that stands out just because the Lord speaks to me a lot in 22s and triple twos as well. Lord, we come into agreement with your word, with your people, and we speak forth just as you said at the beginning of this word. You 
said you are listening for for those who will decree and speak forth and say let there be so lord we declare as one unit let there be justice in the name of jesus we also speak regarding your man 45 let there be vindication in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you because we know that the light of your truth will absolutely obliterate the darkness for all the plans of the corrupt are falling apart and they shall not prevail but we, the people of God, shall prevail in the name of Jesus. The name above all names. Hallelujah. We give you thanks. Praise God. Wow. Well, this was a short word. This is what I felt led to bring you today, Friday. Friendly reminder, don't forget to check out that Diana Larkin video from two days ago entitled Phony Christianity. I believe on the thumbnail, I put phony Christians. I forgot it was Christianity, but it works. It works. Amen. Take the time to listen to that and definitely comment. At the very end, I lead you in a prayer of breakthrough, in a prayer of liberation and freedom after having, after the Lord unexpectedly led me to teach on many, many different things that are very, very practical that will help you. Amen. So thank you for your support of this channel. And by support, I mean by you hitting the like, by you being subscribed, by you commenting. That is the support that means the most to me. Amen. So thank you all. The Lord bless you. Over the weekend, I will be releasing more videos, more prophetic words, maybe one that is just an audio. Uh, I have one in mind for tomorrow that may be a little bit longer, so I may just do an audio uh, nonetheless, even if it is just an audio, and you don't see me talking and moving and all that, it's, it's all good. It'll help you to concentrate and put your focus on what you are hearing and listening to. Amen? Well, love you all. The Lord bless you. And don't forget to check out Hank Kuhneman's ministry if he is new to you and you didn't know about him. He's a wonderful man of God, prophet and pastor. Amen? All right. God bless you. Bye-bye.